Hi, and welcome to Project and Things. My name's Eve. Today we're going to make a soap bar holder using a bunch of stones, simple stones we found somewhere, and some resin. And, and to do that, we're going to make two very simple trays. We're going to slap together five pieces of wood to make a very shallow tray. Line all the sides with packing tape, because resin doesn't stick to that. And then seal all the edges with some silicone, for the exact same reason. So the first step of this is lining all the different surfaces with packing tape. Then you nail these pieces together. And using a couple of beads of silicone, you seal all the edges so the resin doesn't run out. And now we're in my kitchen. Now it's time to actually mix the resin and pour it into these things that my wife arranged. So what we're gonna do is put down a garbage bag in case this leaks. And in my city, they're golden at the moment. So fun times. Good thing that didn't break. The lid is under the cat. So that went not as smooth as I thought. We put this thing under in case it leaks and the resin won't stick to this. And now we need to mix up the epoxy. You mix this stuff up by weight. So you do whatever a hundred is of this and then it meets 60 of this. So I'm gonna go for a starter of just like a hundred grams of this and 60 grams of this. Mix it into a little jar and hope for the best. So we have 200 of the resin part and now we need to add 120 of the hardener which makes it 320. 324. And then you simply stir the contraption for a few minutes to mix everything thoroughly together. So it's been 24 hours now and we can remove the molding. Um, the process turned out rather good. The packing tape and the silicone turned out to be a waterproof container and nothing spilled out. Um, the end result is very good. It's clear. There's a little bit of the markings from the tape on it, but that's on the bottom. No one sees that anyway. And it serves its function. Soap on the soap holder and there you go. Looks very good. I did end up making way too much uh, because I over poured and decided to just make double the amount. Turns out I didn't need that. So we ended up casting a few more of these tiny ones that we're just gonna have as ornaments somewhere or hand out to someone, I don't know, free gifts basically on the side. And with the very last of the resin and the smallest stones that we were gonna throw anyway, we ended up making one more bonus one for the kitchen soap. So since I'm in my kitchen, I'll put the thing away. 
And I'm pretty happy with the way these turned out. Uh, it kind of looks like just river stones in water, which is what we were going for. Now it's river stones and water with soap on top. Thank you guys very much for watching. If you like these things I do, then please consider subscribing. Uh, there should be a button to do so below. And somewhere off the side here should be a bunch of other videos all about making stuff. So until next time, thank you, bye.